Hey what's up everyone this is Nash and this is my android setup episode number 3. In this series I show you my home screen, the themes I'm using, icon packs, current launcher and of course the custom ROM I'm currently running. So as you can see I'm using Redmi Note 4 for last one week because the battery life is very good and this setup is called transparent setup. First of all the custom ROM I'm running is EOSP extended 7.1.2 and the version for that is 4.4. Outstanding ROM, pretty stable, you can check the full review and this ROM is available for many phones. So the launcher of my choice is Nova Launcher Prime, an outstanding launcher, I have been using this for last 2 or 3 years. If you love customization, then you should definitely try this launcher. And the 3D wallpaper or live wallpaper you are watching is multi-layer wallpaper, an app called 3D wallpaper, you can download that and have these kind of wallpapers. And this kind of wallpapers doesn't consume your battery and there are plenty of wallpapers to choose from. So I have been using this wallpaper app for last one week and it's really outstanding. Some wallpapers are 3 layers, some wallpapers are 4 layers and some wallpapers are 5 layers too. Now let's go to home screen and let me show you my setup. On top of course status bar, then I have one creative super widget, link for that will be in the description box below. Following that I have my 12 most used apps. These are the apps I use every day so I don't like to keep them in app drawer. Just below that I have my google now super widget which I use to go to google now cards or set the reminder. And the very bottom I have my 5 icons pixel swipe out gesture enable dock. Also not to forget the beautiful icons you just saw are called crispy icons, I just love this icon pack. They have plenty of icons available for almost any app you want and also you can request icons to developer for particular apps. Now let's talk about the theme, I'm using Substratum theme called transparent and obviously it makes notification drawer and pretty much all the windows I open transparent, gives nice model look and personal touch to my setup. This is beautiful theme and mostly compatible with almost all the OMS supported phones. Now let me show you my Nova settings. Desktop grid I'm using is 10x9 and I'm using the same grid for my app drawer also. And as mentioned earlier I'm using crispy icons, along with that I have many icon packs that I keep changing. So everything I talked about in this video, all the links you can find in the description box below. So that covers almost everything about this setup. If you want to have the same setup on your home screen, then I will provide Nova backup file in the description box below. And if you don't know how to apply that backup file, please watch the video in the i button. I have explained everything step by step over there. And recently I have created a telegram group so you can chat with me and all other subscribers of Game of Roams. So don't forget to check that out. So this is Nas signing out and I will see you next time.